Good morning. Uh, it's not really an update. It's um, thanking you, I guess, more. I uh, want to tell all you that have been praying and keeping Tammy and myself and our family in your thoughts that uh, it's, a, it's, it's a tremendous help. It's, um, it's a big load to carry here. It's uh, scary. Um, knowing I have all of you, all of her friends, our friends, family, uh, <laughs> I shared with her last night that we have people from the UK and South Africa and all over the world, uh, all over this country, this fishing community, catfish community in particular. Uh, yeah, she's pretty, uh, she was pretty amazed uh, sharing some of the kind words and things you guys have been saying for us. And So anyway, her energy levels are up uh, each day since she's been on the feeding tube. Um, this morning she got up and uh, uh, did some self-care. She washed her hair, of course it's dry shampoo, which is yucky. Obviously I don't, I don't have that problem, but uh, yeah, it's um, baby steps. Um, we won't know, obviously, I think I've already mentioned this till Tuesday, um, what we're going to do, what the prognosis or what the outcome or treatment's going to be. We already know it's carcinoma. We're not really sure if it's spread or how far, or, you know, we'll find that out Tuesday. But as of today, since we're living each day, uh, day at a time, moment by moment, really, um, I'm having a decent day this morning. She, she slept, uh, decently last night and... Her pain levels are, are definitely going down and um, she's getting more comfortable. She's got the energy to actually uh, move around, walk around a little bit in her room, um, you know, go to the bathroom by herself. And yeah, so uh, making steps, um, you know, we're not out of the woods by any stretch of the imagination. We're definitely um, in for a long fight here. But you guys are. Uh, you guys are making this, uh, helping me carry some of that load. Helping her carry some of that load. It's, uh, like I said before, it's a big deal. Anyways, I wanted to show you a little bit about uh, where I'm at. I'm here in Riverside, and it's ironic that I'm uh, about five minutes away from what I uh, considered my home lake. <laughs> it's just over here. Uh, growing up, it's Lake Paris State Recreational Area, and uh, I've actually uh, thought about while she's sleeping or being treated or off doing something here in the hospital or with doctors that I could maybe run up to the lake and throw my poles in for an hour or two. Uh, I, I always have a couple poles in the car with me, and I just keep forgetting to bring my tackle box because I'm not really sure if that's appropriate while she's in the hospital, but um, living on monsters and uh, hospital food. Last night I was treated to my stepson, brought me some uh, beef steak from a local restaurant here, so it was really nice to have that. And anyway, thank you guys. Thank you everyone for uh, helping me carry this. Thoughts and prayers and It's uh, baby steps. Thank you.